I would say, well met, brother, but I cannot shake off the needle itch of dread. Is something wrong? I followed the abbot here, kept him in my sight. But the monks, his servants, I have seen nothing of them. Dead? I do not think so. But there is no good here in this grave hush. And where is the abbot now? In his quarter. And be on your guard. Does this have the stench of betrayal to you, brother? Why would the godly shepherd ally with the heretic? Kinnebed is a man who craves power and position. With Tedman dead, he must find it somewhere else. There is truth in that. Keep your eyes and blade sharp. have arrived. Come. Supper's ready. The dear abbot sent me a warm invitation, said my friends were eager to meet with me. It's early for supper, I know. But Kinnebert's ale goes so well with roasted lamb and cinnamon blueberry peas. I couldn't resist. Where is my brother? Is he... is he not here? Mon Dieu. I never told him. Kill her, and we'll never find Sigurd. Sit, Ava. Eat. And let me tell you the tale of a man who talks with gods. You mock me. I have killed for much less. Of course you have. Isn't that the way of this ugly world? We call the sheep? in the flock as we see fit, you and I. Most who walk the earth are little more than talking blood bladders, wasted flesh. But not Sigurd. Sigurd is something else. Sigurd has been touched. He is deified. The gods, they speak through him. You lured him in with that lie. Your words are vile and blight. You should have listened, Avar. I tried to tell you. The gods are real, and their power is within our grasp. You will never find him. Not till I have had my fill. To old friends. This really is delicious, Kinnebert. Is it cloves I taste? Well, that concludes supper. Kill them, and bring their bodies to my sanctum in Canterbury. They will be upon us soon. Maybe there is another way out. Okay, let's slip that her sanctum is at Canterbury. She did. And with no cause. I'd approach the place with caution. It may be a lie. It may be, but it's the only lead we have. I hope all this innocent sacrifice is worth the trouble. It's my brother. Of course it is. Then come. Let us dive into the moor of death. I was never keen on seeing my winter years. It will not be for nothing, Eivor. We will find Sigurd. It's not...
looking for a worthy challenger. This place swarms with Furke's people. Sigurd will be well guarded. Caution and subtlety should be our path. Ready? Follow me. Why would Fulke give us her sanctum? She baits us, cocksure and arrogant. But she cannot see failure in her path. Whatever we find there, keep your head. You chastise me like a child, Bessem. <laughs> Nothing is served with your brutal end. You have much to do in this life. I know it. More riddles, sly tongue. No riddles. I sense a Give greatness a within with you this. both. Your destiny is not to stain the stones of this hothouse with your blood. Two arms, Bessem! So we are to blood in like a fox. Still here, we'll burn this Christ house to the ground. Have a look, Sunan. There's the target. Shoot. Jesus. 
still here. We'll burn this Christ house to death. the way to full case sanctum then let us go if she's still here we'll burn this christ house to the ground full i'm here face me have a care Abel. you will play into our hands what does it mean these word tangles that speak of elves and demons sacred soldiers there. I may have. We must be sure. A fortress in Sussex. Secret is running out of time. You order trained soldiers there. Anything else? Documents of interest to the hidden ones. Hyden will surely want to look. But for Sigurd, Porchester is our only lead. If he is in Porchester Castle, we'll need a massive army to crack its walls. I have many friends in England now. If I call on them, they will come. They will. Bassam, she severed his arm clean off. Can a man survive such a loss? Physically, he can. Mentally, it's hard to say. So much stress can drive a man to despair. If you suggest he might take his own life as Tedman did, banish that idea. I must tell my people at the settlement that their Jarl remains a captive. They will not take it well. We will not fail again, Eivor. I'll scout ahead and send word to the settlement when I know more of Porchester. Be ready. A long time ago, at a desert oasis, far away, a place of mystery, wonder. Eivor, you come alone. I fear what that means for Sigurd. I... I could not find him. That madwoman, Folke, she... She slipped away. Took him to Sussex. We need an army. Call on our alliances. Remind them of their oath to me. 
We must act before. Before. Before what, Eivor? She tortured him, Ranvi. Did unspeakable things. Severed his arm and left it as a gift. I fear she means to kill him. Slowly. Gods. I want to see the Alliance map. What can you tell me of Vinland? Is it a real place or merely a rumor? Rumor or not, I found someone willing to sail you there. She claims to have seen it once before. If she's willing to risk her life beside me and make the long journey, I'll take her at her word. Nessa is her name. Meet her at the docks when you are ready to leave. I'll go now and end the life of Gorm Chut the Sun, where the Valkyries cannot find him. It is a long voyage, Eivor. Be careful. Something? Good day to you, stranger. Nessa, is it? I am Eivor. Ranvi said you would be my guide. That is right. Passage to across the seas to St. Brenton's land, is that right? Ranvi called it Vinland. One and the same. It is a three week trip by longship. Arduous, dull, possibly fatal. Should we survive, you'll be compensated. Eivor, before you go, you must be dressed as a thrall when you arrive. To be seen as you are would raise suspicions. Gorm runs this new camp, and it is a good bet all but a few will be loyal to him. Good thinking. Only taking care of our prized Drenger. First things first, Eivor. My ship, my rules. Second, you follow the rules. Third, if you listen to my rules, you live. Understood. Good. Let me know when you're ready and we'll get going. I'll leave my gear behind. It's the part. To Vinland we go. Hop in! We'll leave now! Three cold weeks on the whale road. Past mountains of ice and kingdoms of stone. Saga lands. All this way to kill a man. Gorm Kjotveson, the son of my father's old foe. What dark work does the Order have so far across the open sea?
someone in charge. I'd better step with care. No friends here. You! You look stronger than most of the others. What's your name? Yora of Jorvik. Yora? As in horse? My father never wanted children. What is this place? Newhaven. A place found on no map. Are we settling here? That's not our plan. Too many wild folk in the woods. They threaten us. You ask too many questions, horse. Your task is to keep your mouth shut and do as I tell you. Now, unload that ship and then I'll... Hildy, we can't find Olaf. Look, he says, not again. We cannot send supplies to Gorm without his guidance. Ugh, pull what supplies we have to the nearest camps then. Gorm's men will do the rest. Let me go. I can carry whatever supplies Gorm needs. That's Olaf's job, horse, not yours. You stick to this port and keep your head down. Ask around about Olaf. Someone must know where he has run off to. If I can find this Olaf, he may know where Gorm is. Nessa, is your ship headed for England? It is. No, I must... <sighs> Grab a shovel from Gorm's storehouse? No, it is a rotten place, that storehouse. Have you seen it? <laughs> a bloody mess. If it's a mess, then... Smashed crates. Somebody crawled off, left a trail of blood. And finding Olav may be the key to finding Gorm. Or at least the helpful ally. Someone picked the lock and got away. Or was hauled off. Could be a trail. Someone broke through here. Made quite a mess. Could be Olav went this way. Get my bearings. Hmm. <laughs> 
Those two carry themselves like leaders. It's worth a try. friends do you do we do we understand one another oya kanya tera kero onu jok no hoda ti gade ki ga yungwe do any of you speak norse or saxon so za de gwat ki ga yungwe ya te de wa yanderi ya de yungwe ye hri ze ona dini to dini go hra di hantos ne ga Giga o zidaa wa o nazi ne giga yungwe tigade na ne e this is sunen a name means insight yanja dahawe giga tinue oya ganyatara keronu itres danu ahinasku ahoya dagenha toka ahuna darohage giga sunen you made us some friends these huts and clothes. And I need to there still. Mm. Waterfalls are places of power in the old sagas. Giga oya ganyatera keheronu rodaska. Nine days I hung in the tree. Nine days. You hear me? There is a language I know well. But the words are mine sick. Tunde gantiga, roja datku, zatsetsant doga askweni, toner era anja da hawite nega. Then I threw my eye at the well. This is wisdom. Sounds like the wind. Who are you? Olaf, I am. Olaf. Called the unlucky. Don't you believe it? And where is, uh... Promise you will do it quick. What? Do not stab me from behind, Drengur. Like Sigurd and the dragon. Please. I'm not here to kill you. I've come for Gorm. N not not here to kill me? Not today. Oh, stay clear of Gorm, then. He's not a good man, not a good man at all. Why would you need to see such a terrible man? It is a matter of honor. Gorm owes me a great debt. Let's leave it at that. Oh, good. Yes. Yes, honor is good. Olaf will help you. Olaf will help you so much. Honor is the only thing. Yes, the only thing. I saw signs of a struggle at your camp. Did something happen between you and Gorm? Nothing to speak of. He, um, did not care for me trading with the villagers here. Beat me and put me in chains. I slipped away free. Not so unlucky, am I? Still alive, yes. Still alive. Good. Point me toward Gorm. Not possible. He is away. Far away at the camps in these woods. All well guarded. Might be Camps. Is he settling here, or searching for something? Searching, yes. Always searching, and never finding the mean, mean background. And how do I find these camps? I can show you. Follow, follow, follow. Olaf, would you tell me something? Anything Olaven can tell, Olaven will tell my new and big friend. Why would Gorm cross the sea to this nameless wilderness? 
It seems a great risk for so little. Dawn carries with him a crystal that talks. It tells him where to go and what to do. A talking crystal? It is truth. The elf stone tells him to seek, and so he seeks. And when it says dig, he digs. Such a mystery. What is he digging for? <laughs> that is a mystery he will not tell. <laughs> but my guess is the best guess. He seeks the door to Jotunheim. <laughs> look! Out across the river. One of Gorm's camps. All look like that. All of them. They are well did you say? Oh, yes. By fierce men. Warriors who attack any stranger on sight. Anyone, and they are all well armed. Not like you, as well equipped as a stable hand. <laughs> it does not take much to kill a man. But sharp steel helps. Oh, yes. You are not wrong. I could use better weapons. Olavur will help. Gather ore and hides to barter for war gear. Ore and hides? I can find out there? Yes. Yes! Some in the woods. Much more at Gorm's camps than traded all with the people here. Easy as a smile. Yes. Yes. I don't understand the language. Can you translate for me? No need, no. We talk with signs. Just walk up to a trader and start trading. Take this. Some goods to get you started. Thank you for this, Olaf. And until I say otherwise, speak nothing of this to anyone. Might be a good idea to trade, now that I'm here. He seems eager to trade goods and... I must be on my way. God, the Jodadu. I must take my leave. I can hike into the woods straight for Gorm. Or gather raw materials and trade for better weapons. You die!
Mark skipped his turn. Take you back to Newhofen. So I'll ask for a... Gorham is in these woods somewhere. You have some weight on you. there. I will find you, Gore, no matter how long it takes. Brother! Brother! You should have listened to me. You have always been too selfish, reckless. Even Mother said so. Blame not the adventurer, for the pull of blood songs can tempt even the gods. Where do I go now? Without you to guide me, what should I do? Lost! <laughs> I am lost. Remember your brother and all that he is. Bring home his tales and let his legacy be grown. That is all we are. Words and song. I will hone my bowcraft. And he will smile upon me from above. He will be proud. Thank you for bringing him back. Thank you. I go the best hunter the ever. Just like you, brother. Quite a number you've taken. <laughs> it was not me alone. My friends and I won them. We call ourselves the Toothbreakers. Sadly, we were separated by a beast of a kind we have never seen. In one fell swoop, it tore our group apart. We are supposed to meet here to hunt that creature before returning home. And so, I wait. Wait in safety then. Safe travels and watch the woods.